technique that I used, I was able to kind of find some science phenomena and present that to the kids through a gift. Kind of a funny way of getting them to think about what we're going to be talking about. However, another way you can use a gift um, as a teacher is kind of to get them thinking um, about what you want them to do. For example, one of my favorite searches um, for Giphy is thinking. So it's just kind of a fun way to remind kids that I want them to take a moment and pause and think. There's a lot of characters on here that kids can probably relate to or some funny faces. Um, I'm going to take this one right here. I'm going to show you what I'm going to do with it. So let's grab Elmo thinking. Remember that we want to grab the long GIF link. And I'm going to go in here, insert image by URL, copy that in here, and I'm going to insert. Now this GIF's only purpose is really to entertain the kids, catch their attention, maybe get them to do what I'm actually asking them to do. And I'm going to add a text box that says gravity on it. And I'm actually going to overlay it on top of Elmo here because he has that empty space above him. I'm going to use that to my advantage. And so now it looks like Elmo is thinking about gravity. 